military members may not be able to vote in time for the Wisconsin primary. The federal government's so mad about it, they are taking the state to court. Lacey Crisp is live in Madison. So Lacey, what happened here? Well, the federal government is suing the state because local clerks didn't send absentee ballots to military members overseas in time. Now, the Government Accountability Board is hoping with a little public embarrassment, it will force local clerks to comply with the law. And we are not living up to that. Nat Robinson with the Government Accountability Board says local clerks are not living up to their responsibilities for military members overseas. According to the GAB, out of 1,851 municipal clerks in the state, 65 sent out ballots late to military members overseas, and 347 never responded to the GAB's request for the information. With the agreement in the lawsuit, the federal government has agreed to give local clerks a little extra time to make sure the ballots are counted or extremely serious about getting compliance. The GAB released its list of top five offenders and how many ballots they failed to send out in time. I called the clerk from Whitefish Bay who argued she emailed out her ballots in time. They had a list of top five offenders and you're on that list? That's odd. Um, I'm pretty sure that they had sent out our ballots. But the GAB admits they can't punish those clerks who did miss the deadline or fail to respond to the GAB. Unfortunately, we do not have the tools or the teeth to uh, impose uh, penalties in order to compel compliance. Personally, I wish to hell we did. And this is the second time the federal government has taken the state to court over this law. On your side, live at the Capitol, Lacey Crisp, today's TMJ4. Okay, Lacey, thanks.